The Denver Regional Council of Governments is proud to present the 2017 John V. Christensen Award to Tom Clark. Tom began his extraordinary career in economic development as Director of Commercial and Industrial Development in Illinois in the late 1970s. He came to Colorado as Director of Economic Development for the Fort Collins Chamber of Commerce and quickly proved his mettle. Among his major accomplishments was bringing the Anheuser-Busch Brewery to the Northern Front Range. Eventually, he accepted a position in Denver, and for many years, Tom led the Regional Economic Development Office, serving as a key player in virtually every major business relocation and expansion in our area. He served as the Executive Vice President of the Denver Metro Chamber of Commerce, as well as the CEO of the Metro Denver Economic Development Corporation. Tom is quick to point out he couldn't have accomplished so much without a team effort. So we'll just say among the many of achievements of his teams, the short list includes construction of Denver International Airport, bringing the Rockies to Denver and construction of Coors Field, the new Mile High Stadium, World Trade Center Denver, instrumental in the passage of fast tracks, establishment of direct international flights to Asia and Europe, and the Rocky Mountain Regional Office of the U.S. Patent and Trademark Office. One of Tom's most lasting contributions may be establishing a new spirit of cooperation in how we do economic development in our region. He is nationally recognized for his advocacy for regional cooperation, bringing together competing local governments and business groups in a collaborative framework. Metro Denver Economic Development Corporation works with 70 partner groups along the Front Range. From the time he arrived in our region until his retirement last month, Tom has helped shape this area into something very special. The John V. Christensen Award recognizes excellence in regionalism, and this board is proud to present the 2017 award to someone who not only exemplifies this spirit, but who has changed the face of our region in such a significant way. Congratulations and thank you, Tom Clark.